É o que eu digo, vamos mimar o Tyler porque oh, eu fiz. Tá bem, porque eu fiz é, com que ele ficasse zangado na última, no último capítulo, então vamos ser bonzinhos. Hey, that's not cool. Sam has a serious problem. Sorry. It was a low blow. He really freaked out when he saw that gun rack. Remind me to take it down later. Se calhar porque ele deve ter deixado a arma lá. Allison, do you know who né? this is? Okay. Zamina. This is Zamina. Obrigado. Where did you find? Do you know who that is? Uh, yeah, that's Carol, Eddie's mom. I've seen other pictures of her, but never this one. Man, look at Brown and Marianne. She looks really happy. Can I? Careful, the glass is Ow. broken. Are you okay? It stings. Let's go see mom. But she'll get mad. You weren't even supposed to be here. Aguenta os cavalinhos que ainda quer explorar isto. Acho que ainda tem coisas aqui para ver. I feel something strong. It's making my teeth tingle. Well, aparentemente não. Whatever. Vamos continuar então. Ataca <risos> dentro. Ah, burro. Agora sim é que eu tenho que acompanhar a lembrança. Mas não é um zombi. Podem andar um bocadinho mais rápido, se for favor. I can't figure out what's going on. I don't know, but I remember that whatever Eddie had to do, whatever that call was about, it was tearing him up. Tearing him up? He was being a total cop, and Marianne got pissed and threw him out. Here, I'm gonna show you what I remember. There, by the house. I had to make that call. I was just following the law. Oh, yeah? And this little visit right here? What would the law say about this, huh? Look, I didn't have to come out here, but I did. You're a goddamn hypocrite. Get out of here! Marianne. <sighs> I said get out! Out! What? She didn't throw the picture at him. You sure about that? He was being a complete dick. How can you be sure? We were eavesdropping. We could barely see a thing. What do you think happened then? Ah, escolhas, escolhas. Look. I had to make that call. I was following procedure. It's what I'm legally required to do. Then why are you here? Pretty sure this isn't procedure. I wanted you to hear it from me. Please, please. Mary Ann. I'm sorry. Please just go. How do we keep remembering the same thing so differently? It was a long time ago and, well, memory is a tricky thing. Wait, when did that happen? I'm not sure. I think it was the exact same day she attacked you. That's what I thought. But Uncle Eddie said he hadn't seen Marianne for weeks. Yeah, that was bullshit. And what was all that about following the law? What was he doing here exactly? Não faço ideia, né? I don't know. I have no idea. We shouldn't jump to any conclusions. Look, I know he took care of you. But that doesn't make him incapable of lying. I can't see him being that cold with Marianne. 
even if he was being a cop. I mean, I can, but who knows? I guess memory's a tricky thing, huh? Escolha uma lembrança do Tyler ou a lembrança da Alison. Marianne estava triste ou Marianne estava brava? É pá, não sei meu, não sei. O polícia não parece ser mau, mas ao mesmo tempo eu tenho medo dele estar nos a a persuadir de alguma maneira, não sei. Eu entendo mais o lado da Alison porque o Tyler, eu acho que ele tem uma má visão graças a as coisas que aconteceram com ele, portanto, eu acho que eu vou seguir mais o lado da Alison. Say Brown really felt bad about whatever he came out to tell her. Yeah. It was still the day she attacked us. He still lied. Now what? We go and get a straight answer from him. Right now? Yes. I'll go get my car keys. But what will these mountains of trash do without us? Fuck the trash. Estou-me a afastar muito do Tyler, mas eu sinto que é o mais correto, mas vou tentar ver se a próxima opção que me apareça possa ajudar a, a que os dois fiquem um pouco mais próximos para não ser completamente para o lado de eles odeiam-se. Man, eu não acredito que o Brown lied. I mean, I may not be the guy's biggest fan, but he's always talking about the truth and the law and shit. Do you have to be so happy about it? What? I know you've been waiting for something like this. Something that proves Eddie's an asshole. But gloating about it is really not cool. Mm. Oh, it's Tina. I, I gotta take this. Yeah, J just a sec. I'm parking the car. Guess I'll just go stretch my legs then. Just give me a sec. Okay, Tina, what's going on? Hi, hon. I've got someone who is super interested in seeing the house. Oh, that's amazing. Uh, when? They're just in the area for a couple of days, so they'd like to come by day after tomorrow. Oh, uh, I'm not sure it'll be ready. I appreciate that, but we've kind of got a lot going on over here. Did I mention it would be an all cash offer? É pá, é melhor a cena do Tyler caga na casa. Vamos vender de outra maneira. It's not the right time. Hours. I'm sorry, but it'll be a total mess. I don't want to waste anyone's time. Well, I think I just made Tina's shit list. Pronto, pelo menos assim já consigo fazer com que a... com que o Tyler goste um pouco mais de mim. Avistamento de ursos comuns, ninha menina, menina, salmão, não alimento ursos, blá blá blá, ursos, pronto, ok, está certo. Mas eu não posso passar por aqui, então vou continuar. Dee and I did that trail a couple years ago. We drank ice cold beers when we reached the summit. Whose votes are you looking to win out here, Tom? The bears? Okay. The artist really nailed this one. Dorian Key. Kind of rings a bell. Okay. Looks like you found a nice spot. 
we've been here before, right? Nice spot indeed. I feel like I've been here before. So, Tina? Tina West, our realtor. Oh, that Tina. What'd she need? She had someone who wanted to see the house, but he could only come by day after tomorrow. And you told her no? Yeah. We need more time than that to get things cleaned up and, you know. Thanks. Well, what if it's the only call we get? And I guess we just rolled and lose our minds in that fucking house. <laughs> Ooh. Sounds like a plan. <sighs> so, poor Tina called, we were talking? Yeah. I'm not happy your foster father fucked up. Oh, yeah? Because you sure sounded he like it. He hid information about Marianne. I know! You just don't have to rub it in! He doesn't get a pass just because this is uncomfortable for you. I'm not giving him a pass. It's just... hard. This whole damn situation is hard. Do you think I liked learning all that shit about Tessa? This town, these people, they're just memories to you. But it's my home, Tyler. My friends, my family. And as much as I want answers, I'd rather not lay waste to my entire life to get them. I didn't come here to ruin your life, Allison. Just want some answers. I know. That's why we're doing all this, right? Our hometown looks pretty picturesque from here, doesn't it? You're way more attached to this place than you let on. Come on, Tyler, help me out here. Why do you shut people out like this? You're literally talking inside my head. Not sure how I could shut you out even if I tried. You know what I mean, Ty. Now, you're the star, and I'm the compass. Okay, and don't cheat. I know you were sending me fake hints last time. I did not. Yes, you did. Okay, okay, I won't do it again. <laughs> you were always accusing me of cheating. Because you totally did. It was a cool game. Guessing where you were just by feeling what you felt? Yeah. I can't believe we played it in public, though. We probably looked like tiny freaks shouting nonsense. Well, we were freaks. But that's why we were awesome. You never wished we fit in a little more? Not at all? No, not really. I mean, we had each other. That was enough for me. So, not too disappointed I turned down our chance to be billionaires? Nah, all that money would have made me soft. And I've spent way too many years polishing my edgy side. You were right to call me out earlier. I was being a jerk about Eddie. I'm all for enjoying the wins as they come. But maybe not at the expense of my father figure? I'll try my best. No tem momento eles conseguiram ficar um pouco mais em paz um com o outro. So I have to warn you. I'm not sure we're getting any answers out of Eddie. You won't have a choice. We're not 10 years old anymore. He tries to protect me from everything. 
occupational hazard. He was always so worried about how I was left out at school. So he'd make me throw these huge birthday parties and invite everyone. And they'd all have to show up because you were the chief's daughter? Bingo. But then they didn't actually talk to me. So I felt like a stranger in my own house. Hey, look what I found. This seems like they made like him as well. Aha! I knew it was still here. I knew we'd been here before. We claimed it as part of the Ronin Kingdom. And it still is. All it needs is a little update. What are you doing? What I wanted to do back then, but I didn't have the guts. There, looking better already. You're right. Way better. So, what's the plan? We go inside and calmly ask Eddie why he was there that day. All right. Let's try to let him get his side of the story out, okay? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. I understand, Mr. Barrow. I'll be sure to let him know. Yes, I have it all written down. Have a good day, Mr. Barrow. Morning, Missy. How do you get stuck working reception? Rose called in sick this morning. I'm covering for her while I try to get my paperwork done. What are you doing here? Just checking in with Uncle Eddie. I'm guessing from the identical features that this is Tyler? Tyler, Denise, Denise, Tyler. Wilson, could you tell Officer Vincenzi that I'll be- Oh. Good morning, Allison. Hi, Uncle. I'm going to take Dr. Torres' statement. No need for Vincenzi to come back to the station. He doesn't seem like he's in the best of moods. Yeah, I don't know what's going on, but he's been a little off all day. Good luck. Nice to see you. Great. He has an excuse to brush us off. I'm sure he'll make time. Hey, he speaks. How's Delos treating you so far? It's been good to see Allison. She's been talking nonstop about you lately. I know she's happy to have you here. Hey, been meaning to say, Allison showed us that article you wrote for the Juno Daily last year. You were spot on. The state needs to be giving way more money to youth centers. Fireweed was lucky to have you. Thanks. I spent a lot of time fighting for more outdoor activities. Made some enemies in the administration over that one. But the first time those kids summoned Mount Roberts, man, they were so proud. It felt great. I know exactly what you mean. I um, volunteer sometimes with the JCE. You know, give lectures about police work, lead group talks when I can. Wait, really? That's awesome. Yeah, and I don't mean to preach, but the kids in those groups, be it Fireweed or the JCE, they need people who really understand them. People who know where they're coming from and will fight for what they need. Anyways, sorry for the rant. Oh, hello, kids. Hello, no, I have a problem. Adults? Everything all right? Your uncle said you two were going to be knee-deep in trash for a few days. A few days? That's optimistic. It feels like every time we clear out a drawer, two more just appear out of thin air. Ah, huh. yes. You got my sympathies. When we emptied Linda's parents' house, oof. I thought we'd have to rent a back home. How is Linda? I feel like I haven't seen her in months. Good. Yeah, she started working over at the high school as the librarian. Pay's not great, but she gets to see the kids every day, so... I bet Brendan's thrilled. Oh, yeah. 
Happy as any teenager who's got to spend extra time with his mom. Well, I'll let you work. <laughs> no worries. You're not a bother. Don't fuck with guys. Dr. Torres, you said your daughter was Tyler Ronan. Yes. Good to see you again. You've gotten tall. That usually happens between ages 11 and 21. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, uh, welcome home. Henderson. Different last name? Yeah. Thanks. It's been a while. So, what brings you two around? Quem me ver do lugar? Luzes neon e comidas fedorentas. Tem que não. Quem me ver do lugar? We're here to see Chief Brown. Oh boy, what do you do now? Suspects wanted for a felony. Oh well, don't forget to read him his Miranda rights. So, is there anything I can help you with? Quer saber os arquivos da Marianne? Não, não. Deixa estar. Não vamos ser chatos. Busy day around here. No. The fire alarm went off three times in the span of an hour this morning. <laughs> I thought the chief was going to rip that alarm right off the wall. All right. Link to the report station you called yesterday. The fire alarm. Where was I in this report? Ah, right. Okay. Não consigo falar mais. 